Brain vs. Eye. Unveiling the neuroscience behind our fear of artificial intelligence. For many years, popular culture through movies, TV shows, and books has presented a narrative centered on the potential negatives of AI. This continuous exposure has amplified fear and apprehension toward AI in the collective mindset. Due to this, the fear of artificial intelligence is growing, especially as the latest AI developments are hitting the news daily. However, neuroscience can help us address this fear. The rapid evolution of AI has been a cause for celebration and apprehension alike. While we marvel at the leaps in technology, there's also a growing fear, a fear tied to loss of control, privacy, and even the potential diminishing of human value. Neuroscience, the study of our brains and nervous systems, provides insights into why these fears exist and how we can manage them. Our brain's fear center, the amygdala, is responsible for our emotional responses to potentially threatening and unfamiliar situations. The amygdala plays a significant role in some people's fear of AI. It senses the uncertainty and potential threats that AI might pose, triggering fear responses. So, what are these fears exactly? One of the primary fears is the loss of control. The idea that an AI could develop to a point where it acts independently, and perhaps even rebelliously, is a common concern. Neuroscience tells us this fear stems from our deep-seated need for autonomy and control over our environment. The second fear revolves around privacy. With AI's ability to collect, analyze, and utilize large amounts of data, people fear a breach of their personal and confidential information. This fear is deeply linked to our brain's sensitivity to social threats, a fundamental human instinct for survival. The third fear is the fear of losing human value. As AI increasingly takes over tasks once done by humans, there is a fear that human skills will become obsolete. This fear reflects our innate need for purpose and a sense of contribution. Understanding these fears from a neuroscience perspective is one thing, but how can we address them? Firstly, we need to dispel the misconception that AI can achieve human-like consciousness. While AI is capable of mimicking human intelligence and learning, it does not possess consciousness or emotions. AI works based on algorithms and data inputs, and it doesn't have personal motivations or desires. Secondly, addressing the fear of privacy loss requires stringent ethical frameworks for data handling. By ensuring that AI systems respect user privacy and confidentiality, we can mitigate this fear. Lastly, we need to change our perspective of AI from a competitor to a collaborator. By promoting the concept of human in the loop, where humans and AI systems collaborate, we can leverage AI's strengths while maintaining human oversight and value. Our fears about AI are deeply rooted in our neuroscience. However, with understanding and proper measures, we can ensure that the rise of AI is viewed not with fear, but with informed optimism. By dispelling misconceptions, enforcing ethical data practices, and promoting collaboration between AI and humans, we can shape a future where AI serves us, not scares us. Remember to like and subscribe for more neuroscience news updates.